it now seems that it's going to be very almost unthinkable that NATO does another operation, except for Article 5 collective defense, just with its own members. Who can rebuild order? Yeah. And oftentimes uh, that question will be addressed to NATO. The whole concept of operations uh, will become a bit broader. You know, partners are now part of virtually every aspect of NATO. And NATO was formed in a strategic environment that was very clear on in and out. Now we have a much more diffuse order. Partnerships are not just individual countries, they're also other international organizations. We will have uh, cyber attacks and counter uh, attacks. Well, cyber is the ultimate asymmetric weapon. The degree to which we depend on the functioning of these systems is at the same time uh, our greatest vulnerability. You think that, for example, a NATO missile shield uh, in Europe means that then we don't need, for example, to have nuclear weapons any longer? It's still a lot of a nightmarish. You know, we can probably assume that the larger the number, the more will go wrong. Is, is the, the, the NATO-Russia relationship good enough to to do it as a joint project. You think we, we have the ability significantly to influence the way Russia will go in future? Russia is rather with Europe than uh, sees itself as a part in Europe. The, the community of leaders inside NATO uh, has had its difficulty to find a common approach uh, to Russia. Should we really be seriously worried now that uh, America is going off in a different strategic direction? The United States will have and maintain a genuine interest to remain a European power. But Europe obviously now you know, has to get its act yeah. together. I don't see uh, the US really uh, relativizing the Article 5 commitment because that would that would massively uh, undermine the US role in NATO or the US role as a European power.